What is up, disc golfers? Today on Iceberg TV, I want to give my opinion on the Ricky Wysocki controversy. Um, is he going to stay with Innova? Is he going to leave Innova? Um, there's a lot of speculation that Ricky's going to go back to Trilogy, either Westside or DD. I think the initial rumors were DD, and then there was rumors that he was going to go to Westside because they're making all these moves. And Hunter Thomas was leaking different things on Twitter. Um, but it's all speculative at this point, and we don't actually know. But the rumors are flying that Ricky doesn't want to be with Innova anymore, and Innova doesn't want to work with Ricky anymore. Now, Ricky is a generational player. He just had the best season of his career, and I think he has a world championship looming in the next year or two, whether it be this coming season or the season after. I think Ricky just continues to get better, and his skill ceiling continues to get higher. And Ricky Wysocki is going to be successful regardless of what discs he's throwing. He just needs to find the support that he needs, that, so he needs to find someone that's going to pay him. Ultimately, Ricky is a hustler. Ricky's known for selling lots of discs at events, literally winning first place at an event, and then going and sleeping on someone's couch and setting up shop and selling a bunch of discs. Like, Ricky's a hustler. Ricky's going to follow the paycheck. So Ricky's gonna do whatever he needs to do to get the, the, the biggest paycheck he can get because it literally doesn't matter what discs he has. He's pretty much, he's one of the best players in the world and if he's putting well, he is the best player in the world. And he's by far the best putter in the world, especially from circle two. So the controversy sort of all began when Ricky wins Disc Golf Pro Tour Player of the Year he had the best season of his career, um, points-wise, Disc Golf Pro Tour points. Um, he, he did so well this season, and Innova took their sweet time in congratulating Ricky. We didn't hear anything from Innova, so the fans took it as, you know. At this point, this post is a meme, was the top comment, 118 likes, so people pretty unanimously understand that. The vibes Innova's giving off is that Ricky may not be with them forever. And they really just dropped the ball because winning player of the year is a tremendous deal. And he didn't really get that support that he needs. They should have already had a player of the year disc ready in Ricky's name. They should have congratulated him immediately when it was like what felt like a week or 10 days overdue. And then the other thing people are talking about is Ricky's not in the end of the disc golf calendar. Now, a lot of these pages don't even have specific players in them. But we do see um, Nate Sexton, we see Nathan Queen, and we see some of Innova's players that we know are going to be there long term. But Ricky, as the best disc golfer of the season, player of the year, should be in the calendar if they see if they foresee Ricky being on the team through this season. So um, there's all sorts of little things that people are speculating that Ricky's going to be leaving Innova for one of these other brands. I'd love to hear your guys' comments in the comment section down below. Personally, I think Ricky's trying to leave, but he's not going to leave unless he's going to get a, a huge contract for it. So he's probably scrambling to try and find something big before this next disc golf season starts. And I'm sure he's in negotiations with multiple different companies. I'm sure there's like a hidden bidding war going on on Ricky's behalf. I'm sure these brands all want Ricky on their team. It's all a matter of who's going to pay the most money. And are they going to give Ricky an offer he cannot refuse? Leave your comments in the comment section down below. You are watching Iceberg TV. Take care.